Thursday, October 22nd, 21st. Not sure exactly. We're on the AT and we are heading towards Campsite 23. The trek that we're on is the Jake's Creek Myrie Ridge Loop. And we started at the Clemens Dome parking lot. And a little bit different trek this time as I've got some friends with me. Instead of the wife, it is my friend Rob, Daniel, Aaron, and Nate. And as you can see, we're kind of socked in with the weather right now. It's uh, it's gloomy, it's rainy, typical Smoky Mountain, but the next two days should be pretty beautiful. We got about six more miles to go. And uh, hopefully we get camp set up before the big rain comes in. I think we got about four miles to camp. Finally, just a little bit of a view. Really hoping in the morning we can see something a lot better. It's still beautiful. Let's take a look inside this cave. I'm sure you didn't hear anything dry. Hoping there's a Yeti in here. Oh yeah, that goes way back in there. Decent. Finally got a little peek at the sun. Very refreshing. The naysayers in our group said the sun wasn't coming out today, so I can't wait to rub that in their faces. I'm sure they're happy to see it as well. Now it's like we're almost back in summertime. Everything's green down here. Whole different world. I got a little sore today. Just a touch. I've always been in a tent. Don't see a reason to change. Yeah, you'll smell like it for years. At least three days. I looked into it. It's 300 bucks a bottle. Yeah. Which one? Two or three? Is there a difference? Now when you get that idea. After which, 80, it's which was that's good. a buck what, fifty what is, a bottle? What is well, it? Colonel Taylor? Bottled oh. In, bottled in bond though. Oh. Bond? It's good. I mean, it's let good. Me, I wouldn't pay a buck. Let me get a nip off that. Okay, day two. It's Friday. Just left our campsite 23. And we are heading towards Elkmont on the little Goshen Trail still. And we will be making our way to campsite 27 which is, uh, we're gonna be losing elevation this morning and gaining it back after we hit the Elkmont area. Pretty good campsite last night, plenty of room, good water, uh, good times, good people, a lot of fun. As you can see, this section of the trail is pretty easy walking as compared to the, this is uh, actually north of campsite 23. Prior to that, it was pretty rocky, uh, uneven footing, and generally a slower walk. What it is, maybe it's another one that goes This whole trail just kind of follows right next to the river. It's very peaceful, very beautiful. Nice to listen to. No falling. It's just that bears are here. You have to accept that when you come out here. I agree. 
we're just setting up camp. This deer decided she wants to make camp with us. Now she's looking at me like I'm out of place. I'm gonna say she's 20 feet away. Quick look around camp, campsite number 27. This is where we just had the deer walk through. Pretty decent, it's about maybe 100 yards from, from water. So that's always a good thing. You don't ever want to be too far away. It sucks having to tote your water. That's much in there. What do you have in there? Whiskey. Whiskey. Whiskey makes her frisky. Good morning. It is day number three. We are heading up the Little River Trail. Just left campsite 27 on our way to intersect the AT and ultimately stay the night at Double Spring Gap Shelter. It's about 38 degrees when we woke up and the first bit of this trek is straight uphill. Not super steep, but it's a good, good solid slog. We are on our way <coughs> up here to catch the Appalachian Trail. Still heading our way to Double Spring Gap Shelter. Okay. Sun is shining. There are, you can kind of see some views. If you can peek out through the trees, it's pretty color, colorful. We couldn't pick a better time to come this year. Let's see if I can turn you around and show you. Off in the distance, you can see the color. There we go, trail sign. What we got here? We got uh, 4.3 yeah. to Clemens Dome now. Um, what, at what age do you care to? Okay, finally, after all this, three days on the trail, and we can finally get a good view. Let's go to that valley fall colors. There we go. Another great view down the North Carolina side of the AT. What I just showed you was the Tennessee side. We're just about maybe three, three and a half miles of Clingman's Dome on the Appalachian Trail. So beautiful. So if you never had a chance to look inside an AT shelter, this is Double Springs Gap. And this is what it looks like. Good, you can look inside here. I gotta readjust my settings here. So basically, everybody just kind of piles in and all these boards, and you're gonna, everybody's gonna line in this way all along through here. Six people up top, and then six people down below here. Got a nice little fireplace. Dude, got a place here to prepare your food, eat. It's raining, it's pretty nice. And come outside around the edge. And a little sign here telling you where you can collect your water at. Somewhere back here, you can see right there. The cables. This is where you're supposed to hang your food. So bears are a real thing, obviously. So you'll hang your food on one of these cables and then you'll latch it all the way up top there. And then secure it 
down here at the anchor point right there in the tree. Just a little eyelet. So that's pretty cool. We just passed Double Springs Gap Shelter. We sat there and took a break. And uh, we decided we're gonna make the last three or so miles back to Clemens Dome to the truck because there's beer. Ooh wee. Get you some of that view right there. Not me, of course, <laughs> the mountains. I'm nothing to look at. A little hot? So the whole trip, we've not had many views. And now we get up here in the AT at the very end and you can see it is spectacular. So I've been showing you the Carolina side. This is now the Tennessee side. That's some great footage right there. See all of Gatlinburg, Pigeon Forge. Mount Leconte off in the distance. About 13 miles in for the day. Maybe a mile to go on the AT heading north to Clemens Dome. Our last minute decision gave us three extra miles, but totally worth it. All right. One more awesome view almost to Clemens Dome. I'm gonna say less than a mile. This is looking towards the North Carolina side of the Great Smoky Mountains. So awesome. The views just don't disappoint. So thankful we finally got up this high where we could see something. I'm thinking not sure, but I think that's Mount Lacan right there. Official first beer after 32 solid miles on the trail. It's gonna be a good one. Here, here. Cheers. Gatlinburg Brewing Company. Some of the best beach and best beer around. One week to get to Gatlinburg, stop and get some of this pizza.